EA Sports coverage of the National Football League comes to you from Ford Field here in downtown Detroit, Michigan. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one, as it'll be the Miami Dolphins taking on the Detroit Lions. Jason Sanders now to get this one started and we are underway from Ford Field. And up to about the 26 yard line just across the 25. behind the line of scrimmage. It'll go as a loss of a yard on the game's first play. Second down. They'll keep pounding here with Montgomery. And he's able to take this one up to the 35-yard line. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. They'll run it. Here's Montgomery. And some room to work. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. Well, they were in search of a short gain on third down, and they wind up nabbing over 20 yards. You were telling me this yesterday. That's exactly what they want to do on the opening drive, establish the ground game. Yeah, remember our conversation we were talking about with one of the GMs in the league has told me repeatedly, it's a big man's game. And it's not necessarily size. He's talking about playing some big boy football. Line up, get leverage, knock people back, and establish the run early. Looking for more there on first down, but this throw downfield incomplete. Second and ten. DC, DC. Turbo. Now a give running right is Montgomery. He'll get only three there, so it leaves him with a third and seven ahead. Pretty good little two-play sequence there. You force the incompletion, then a very short pickup. Yeah, now maybe you bring in an extra defensive back or two because you want to try to defend on third down. They like to play those nickel or sub packages, don't they? Pass taken in by his big tight end. And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the two. That's a gain of nearly 40 yards on third and medium to pick up the first. Execution was one of their watchwords leading up to this one. And on that play, able to execute brilliantly here on this opening drive. Oh, how about this call down near the goal line? And they will stop him after a fairly minimal pickup. Give him two yards on that one. Second and goal now. Montgomery is into the end zone. Touchdown, Lions. Our first quarter, maybe too early to talk about statement drives, Charles, but that sure seemed like a statement drive right there. Well, if we're going to talk about statement drives, I think what they're saying is we're going to establish the run. They gave it to him early and often on this drive, and he wound up taking it into the end zone. Extra point by Badgley, up and good. And it's now a 7-0 game. Out is the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. Braxton Berrios selected to bring it out. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. Tongue of Iloa and the Dolphins come up first and 10 at their own 23. They'll run here with Raheem Mostert. They'll get this to the 24 and it's second down. Brandon, to me, what's important right here on this drive is for them to get at least two first downs. They've got to give their defense a chance to settle down, catch their breath a little bit after they give up a touchdown on the opening drive. And he'll be brought down on the 30-yard line after a gain of six. Looks like burst there, and he nicely bit off. A pretty decent game. Final two. They'll try and run here with Mostert. And he gets it to the 34. Good enough for the first. 
It's a gain of four there, and it gives him a new set of downs. Well, they just watched the other team take the ball downfield and score, so they knew that this drive, this opening drive, was on them. And, boy, that was important to pick up that first down there and keep this one going. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. On first and 10, it's Mostert. And he's got it up over the 40 to the 41. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. Now, Brandon, that's the way you want to run the football. There should almost be quote bubbles above the offense right now. Bam, boom, biff. That's how they feel good about moving the football. After one, seven nothing on EA Sports. From the 41, here's second and four. They'll stay on the ground with Moster. And he'll be taken down at the 46-yard line. A gain of five, good enough for the first down. Well, you know they had a third down play on standby just in case, but he says no need with that carry. Runs like that will continually earn him more work in this and future contests. Now a give to Mostert running right. And he's able to take it across midfield before going out of bounds. Just what you want on a first down run. Call it eight yards, and it's second and two. Here's a handoff to Mostert running left. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. 51 yards rushing so far, and this is just their first possession. They've got a new set of downs here. They'll run right side with Mostert. And just good downhill running there as he'll take this to the 15-yard line. Back-to-back -back nice plays, 12 yards that time, and a first down. A handoff running left is Mostert. And he's brought down just outside of the 10 at the 11. Cameron Sutton on the tackle. Not a run that you're going to write home about, but still a good first down run. That's what an offense calls staying on schedule. Three to four yards on first down, you're set up very well for the rest of the drive. On second down, a run by Achan. And he'll get this one down to about the 10-yard line. Call it a gain of a yard, and it's going to bring up third and five. We talk about defenders, specifically linebackers, keeping their eyes in the right spot. He had that eye down the entire time. And you know that's not easily done because they throw a lot of misdirection at you. They try and fool you and get your eyes in the wrong place. But you're right about that one. He correctly figured that one out. And he'll take this into the end zone for a Dolphins touchdown. Raheem Mostert, a 10-yard touchdown run. And the Dolphins are within an extra point of tying up this ball game. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And we are tied at seven. Each team's had it. Each team has scored. 7-7 seven, seven here as the kick's away. Here's Raymond bringing it out. And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. The Lions offense ready to kick off their next drive. So both of these teams, Charles, coming off touchdowns now, but this offense, they just had to stand on the sideline, watch their opponent author a really impressive drive to reach the end zone. And that's caught inside the 35. And he'll work it inside the 30 to the 29-yard line. A big play there for Detroit. 53 yards. So that changes things in a big way. Now from all the way down inside the 30, here's first and 10. Straight ahead with Gibbs here. Stopped at the 24-yard line after a gain of five. And that's exactly what you want on a first down run. Pick up five yards, bring up second and five. The defensive line, though, they've got to figure out a way to out-leverage the guys up front because the offensive line is winning at the point of attack. 
And that'll be caught. It's Sam Brown. And in for the Lions touchdown. Jared Goff to Amon Ross St. Brown. And the Lions will take the lead here in the final minute of the first half. Extra point by Badgley up and good. And that makes the score 14 to 7. Set now to kick this one away, and off it goes. Barrios now from his end zone. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Cost him about five yards as he's tackled at the 20. First down Miami as they get set to start the drive. And with just under a minute to go, they might try to think about mounting a drive here if they can and get in the end zone. Could potentially tie. Oh, what a read on the outside as it's intercepted. Picked off by Kirby Joseph. And the return here will go to the 31-yard line. Line of scrimmage, the 31 now on first and 10. After the interception, here's Golf. That is caught by LaPorta. Touchdown! Sam LaPorta. will extend their lead in the final minute of the half. So, Charles, that's three touchdowns on three drives, and it's just been an offensive barrage so far. Great word, partner, using barrage right there. I'm going to add another word, if you don't mind. How about perfection? No surprise that they're leading right now. Absolute dominance throughout this ball game, and no signs of slowing down. Extra point by Badgley, up and good. And it's now 21-7. Here are the Lions now as they line up and kick this one away. Berrios going to bring this out of the end zone. And he's only going to make it to the 13-yard line and no further. For most people, the excitement of the kickoff return is to see a long one that goes back in the opposite direction. But for the guys covering it, it's being able to stop them deep in their own territory. How about that incredible form tackle right there? Shoulder in the ball carrier, and down he goes. The Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. And with him down two scores, you wonder if they might try and put something together, even if it's just to get into field goal range. Hey, Trying to shake off the interception, he'll look to throw. Oh, everything falling apart now. Another one intercepted. It's the linebacker, Alex Anzalone. And he will bring it back. An interception return for the Lions. Touchdown. That bumps us up to a three-possession game here and only in the second quarter, Charles. They're trying to put this game out of reach before we even hit the locker rooms for intermission. What's even tougher is making up three possessions against a defense that can make impact plays like this. They don't have this game wrapped up quite yet, but two picks already, one to the house. I think it's fair to say they're headed in the right direction. Extra point by Badgley, up and good. And the lead now to three touchdowns at 21. So they throw the pick six. They'll get another shot at it now as this one's in the air. Barrios now from his end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. First down Miami as they get set to start the drive. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Trying to get something positive to happen here before the break, and they sure need it. They went for the big one, but it winds up incomplete. Now a second and ten. Play action, now it's Tua. He'll let this go deep for Waddle. And he drops it incomplete. And their struggles continue here. So back-to-back -back incompletions, and that has him staring at a third and ten. Off of play action, Tungabailoa. And he takes a shot on the release, as this will be incomplete. 
This defense has certainly played well so far in this game, and the coverage has been tight on just about every throw. Forced a few here so far in this game, and now it brings up fourth down. Tug of Iloa going for it on fourth down. He's got his target. That's complete. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the 45. I don't know if I agree with that. I guess they don't care if I agree with that. But, boy, you have to be surprised by that, right? I definitely was surprised that they decided to go for it in this situation. But they must have either felt like they either had a great play call on or they're trying to show extreme confidence. But now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. That's it for the first half. Two more quarters to go. We'll have plenty more to see after the break. And we welcome you back now. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, getting set for quarter number three here. The Dolphins down on the scoreboard, but they'll have it first as we get going in this third quarter. Barrios going to bring this out of the end zone. And he'll be brought down right on the chalk of the 20. The Dolphins at the line ready for their next drive. And you have to think, Charles, down three scores already. They need to play an almost perfect second half to have a solid chance. And that absolutely starts with finding some way to put together a touchdown drive here. They need to be smart, fast, efficient, get the ball to the end zone, and do it again multiple times in order to have a chance to win this game. Once again, it's Moster. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. 89 yards for him on the ground now as he has been terrific here this afternoon. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. Now a play fake. Here's Tug of Iloa. And his throw is incomplete. As a corner, you have to be able to run with guys step for step downfield with man coverage and make up ground quickly in zone. You have to put yourself in position to make plays just like that one we saw there. On the handoff, this is Moster. And forget about finding a lane. He barely had time to look up before he was planted in the backfield. They'll wind up losing three. And now it's third down. Not an easy spot here. He'll be in search of 13 yards to try to pick up the first. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And he's caught. And yeah, he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. A big play there as they get the conversion on third and 13. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Completes it to the tight end, Smythe. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. So from the 17 now, here's a first and 10. Two are going to throw. That is caught by Waddle. Touchdown, Miami. Jalen Waddle from 17 yards out. And the Dolphins are able to cut into this lead as they score on the opening drive of the second half. Extra point up and good by Sanders. And that cuts the lead to 28-14. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. And they'll be set up pretty nicely here as they have it up to the 35-yard line. The Detroit offense ready to begin their drive. And they were terrific in the first half, built up a sizable lead, and it's just been cut into a bit following the opening drive score on the other side. But this is a unit that has to be itching to get the football again. And you can say that again. They've got to be pretty eager because, let's face it, they've had to sit through halftime, then sit on the sidelines and watch that drive. So you can bet that they're saying, let's get on with this. we got to go out there and get some more points. And he'll be tackled at the 45 following a gain of just two. Here comes third in the length of the football. Gone. He's got this complete to Williams. Still going inside the 20. Touchdown, Detroit. Jared Goff with his third touchdown pass of the afternoon. And the Lions 
Lions have moved out in front by three touchdowns. 